Take our lead, let's help you make your mark. Our goal is your satisfaction, let us show you the way. Take your styrofoam out of the trash can. Your garbage man will not accept your trash if they see styrofoam in it. Your neighborhood recycling center also may not accept styrofoam. Save your styrofoam in a safe place. Contact your local post office. Purchase some limonene and orange extract on the internet. Take our lead. Ways to reuse styrofoam packing peanuts. Reuse as packing peanuts. There's no reason why styrofoam peanuts can't be reused as what they were made for before. Stuffing. Alternative to ice. Plant pot fillers. Tighten loose screws. Christmas tree tinsel. The 4th of March 2017. Take our lead. There are two reasons EPS isn't allowed in recycle bins, density and contamination. Polystyrene foam is 95% air so it is not cost effective to store or ship. It is often contaminated with food or drink, and it is difficult to clean because it is so porous. Point nine May 2013. Let's help you make your mark. Find a drop-off site for styrofoam in your area. You can also get in touch with the Alliance of Foam Packaging Recyclers or independent organizations like Earth 911 to search for styrofoam recycling programs in your area. You can find the drop-off station nearest to you by searching the AFPR website. Make your mark, take our lead. Donate it. Go to earth911.com, type in polystyrene and your zip code, and it will tell you where your closest drop-off site is. The Alliance of Foam Packaging Recyclers, AFPR, has a list of centers that will accept your excess apps via mail. Take our lead. Styrofoam is the household name for EPS, a kind of plastic. To throw away styrofoam, remove any recyclable pieces, then break down sheets or blocks into smaller bits you can put in your regular trash can. To recycle, make sure you have plain white styrofoam marked with the triangular recycling symbol. Make your mark, take our lead. When used with food products, especially when heated, styrofoam releases toxic chemicals into the food causing a contamination which can be hazardous to your health in addition. When exposed to sunlight, styrofoam creates harmful air pollutants which contaminate landfills and deplete the ozone layer. Take our lead. Burning styrofoam, or polystyrene, is the least appropriate way to get rid of it for both people and the environment. Research has shown that when styrofoam is burned it releases toxic chemicals and smoke that can damage the nervous system and lungs. Point two two November 2019. Thank you for watching, please subscribe and hit the bell notification.